Hi students, welcome to the problem solving session on uh, displacement current density. Let us see this problem. In a charge free non magnetic dielectric region, the magnetic field is given by H is equal to 5 cos 10 power 90 minus uh, 4y az ampere per meter. Calculate the dielectric constant and uh, the displacement current density. So, what are the things they have given? They gave uh, omega, omega is 10 power 9 because any wave form electric field magnetic field general form is cos omega t. So, omega is 10 power 9. This is beta, beta is equal to 4, right? So, what I have to find the dielectric constant uh, epsilon, I have to find how. So, what is epsilon value and uh, JD displacement current density since it is given vector so we will find a vector and both scalar and vector value okay so we have to find all the things right so if I want to find epsilon how can I find from the given data right V is equal to um, I know that uh, V is equal to okay what are the things they are given epsilon I have to find right so we can write V is equal to C by mu R epsilon R. This we know, right? V is equal to 1 by root of mu epsilon, right? So if it is a free space, uh, I can write mu naught by epsilon, mu naught epsilon naught, but it is a general medium. so we have to write V is equal to C by root of mu, mu R epsilon R. Okay, so let us see this how to get from this we find the epsilon value or dielectric constant value. Okay, so what I need is first I have to find velocity. C I know mu R whether they have given they didn't give mu R. So we have to assume mu R is equal to 1. So let from that we have to find the epsilon R. Okay, first we find velocity. Velocity from where I can find the velocity is equal to f into lambda. If I can from find from here, from beta I can find lambda. So first I find f, right? F is equal to omega by 2 pi. So omega is 10 power 9 divided by uh, 2 pi. So it is 10 power 9 by 2 pi, right? What about lambda? Lambda is equal to 2 pi by beta 2 pi by 4 that is pi by 2 what is my uh, v velocity velocity is f f is 10 power 9 by 2 pi uh, lambda is pi by 2 so it is uh, 10 power 9 so 10 by 4 it is 2.5 into 10 power 8 10 power 9 I split into 10 into 10 power 8, 10 by 4 is 2.5. So, this is what my velocity, right? So, you see velocity is 2.5 into 10 power uh, 8 meter per second, okay? So, from this we find uh, epsilon r, we know v is equal to, I put c by mu r epsilon r, C by mu r root of mu r epsilon r. Mu r they didn't give, so we assume 1. Epsilon r only we have to find. This implies epsilon r squared is, sorry, epsilon r is equal to c squared by v squared. I bring epsilon left hand side and square it. Okay, so from this we can find c is 3 into 10 power 8. This fellow v is 2.5 into 10 power 8 whole square cancel it so from this you get epsilon r is equal to 1.44 that is what the dielectric constant of the medium right dielectric constant is nothing but relative permittivity right so we found a dielectric constant right if you have any doubt on the concept please refer my video on dielectric constant i have put one video on dielectric constant next what i have to find jd JD how, JD, how can I find from the given data? JD, they gave only H value. How to find JD? We know JD is uh, dou D by dou T. 
fine so jd we can find the dot by dot t so how can we find uh, but we, they gave only h value how to find again we have to go for modified ampere circuit law that is del cross h is equal to jc plus jd but the given question is only dielectric medium in dielectric medium conduction current is zero so jd is given by del cross h that's it why i put zero in dielectric conduction current is zero conduction current is available only in conductor so if i find del cross h that will be giving jd right so that is given by what is the thing uh, del cross h h they gave so del cross is a h uh, a y a z uh, rho by rho x rho by rho y rho by rho z what about my h value h is given by okay so phi cos 10 power 9 minus 4 y a z only so there is no x there is no y so 0 0 phi cos into 10 power 9 t minus 4 y right so let us take only this one a x uh, right so a x only possible other multiplication will vanish rho by rho y I cos 10 power 90 minus 4y. If you differentiate, what will happen? Okay, so it will be equal to I cos 10 power 90 minus 4y into minus 4 ax fine so this is what my jd right if you find uh, magnitude of jd it will be jd is equal to a yeah, magnitude both side you take magnitude so this my unit my unit vector will become one so it is phi into 4 20 20 cos 10 power minus 9 t 4 y right ampere per meter square right so this is what uh, jd value okay so this is displacement current density jd vector if you take magnitude it will be like this phi into 4 minus 4 become plus 4 magnitude if you take magnitude okay so that's it that's all about this session if you have any doubt please ask me in comment section thank you